A middle ear infection happens when the space behind your child's eardrum becomes infected. This is called otitis media. It's common in young children, especially during or after a cold. If you think your child has an ear infection, take them to a healthcare provider. The provider will look into your child's ears and may do a simple exam to confirm the infection. Common signs include fever, fussiness or crying, trouble sleeping, ear pain or pulling at the ear, trouble hearing, balance problems, fluid coming from the ear. Call your child's doctor if they have symptoms of an ear infection, have swelling or redness on or around the ear, have a fever that doesn't go away, seem very ill or unusually tired, have fluid, especially pus or blood, coming from the ear. Doctors often prescribe antibiotics, but some ear infections get better on their own, especially in children over age two. In these cases, your doctor may recommend waiting a few days. Pain relievers like acetaminophen or ibuprofen can help. If infections don't go away or keep coming back, your child may be referred to an ear, nose, and throat ENT specialist. Some children need a short surgery to place small tubes in their eardrums. These tubes help airflow and let fluid drain. They usually fall out on their own within six to 18 months. Most ear infections go away without lasting problems. But chronic ear infections, infections that keep coming back, can sometimes lead to hearing problems or speech delays. Your doctor will help you decide if your child needs more treatment or monitoring.